guys and welcome to my channel today i have a really really bad craving i've been craving fried plantain and bean stew that's Ghanaians will call it red red it's a simple dish and i've been craving it and i thought why not teach you guys how to do it i'm not trying to be an expert but somebody might not know how to do it and i thought i'll teach everyone how to do it as well so yeah let's let you know that cooking is very different everyone has a different way of cooking so just because I'm doing it this way doesn't mean you have to follow it you need to understand I have a different preference like I'm going to be cooking with vegetable oil only because I don't eat palm oil so typically this meal is supposed to be done with palm oil but if you don't eat palm oil you can have vegetable oil sunflower oil so yeah I like a lot of chili if you don't if you want to use one that's great I like chili so I'm going to be using a lot more I like a lot of onions I like a lot of garlic so this ingredient adds to my taste and I'm only cooking for two people so if you're cooking for a lot of people then obviously the time that you're going to be using in so the first okay. thing that I'm going to be using is onions I've got two because as I said I do like a lot of onions I've got chili here I might not use all four we'll play about here I've got a bit of ginger in here and I've got garlic I'm gonna be using two of them my usual suspect which is onga you can have maggi cube if you don't have maggi or onga get all-purpose anything that you can use to spice it up a little bit yes I have got pilchards here if you like mackerel I'm normally not a fan of mackerel but today I'm just gonna be using that on here the main ingredient of the meal is my cooked beans this is black-eyed beans and if you want it to cook quicker try and soak it overnight and this is like the main condiment of the meal I have my tomatoes here because I'm gonna go for fresh tomatoes today no tomato puree if you want a tomato puree that's fine but preference is um, fresh tomatoes I'm gonna be blending it with the peppers the gingers and the onions as a base and also as i said earlier i've got my vegetable oil here so i have got kobe as well this is salted fish for anyone asking so this is what i'm going to use to fry my oil and the reason being that it gives it a little bit of an authentic Ghanaian taste kobe you can get from african shops if not you can just get salted um fish from any other um african or caribbean shops and plantain we all know what plantain is it's not a banana and it's not the brother of a banana they're quite similar but this is like a vegetable because you can fry it i guess so yeah i've got plantain which is which i'm going to have it with the bean stew when i finish so yeah enough of talking about the ingredients let's just go ahead and start cooking i'm really hungry basically just cut off my tomatoes my chilies a bit of ginger not a lot and then some garlic depending on how much garlic you like i've got three here i've got two peppers I settled for two instead of four because I'm going to use the other two for something else. And then I've got loads of tomatoes in here. And I've got onions. I'm not going to blend the onions. I'm actually going to be using the onions in the stew itself. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and blend this. first thing I'm gonna do is start browning my onions just get a little bit of oil I'm gonna go in with my macro pilchards, whatever it is. Mm -hmm.
This is for my plantain. It's getting ready. I'm just going to fry the plantain as well because you don't really want to waste time. So you fry your plantain on a medium heat because you don't want it to burn. So just um, let the oil get hot a little bit and then you can go ahead and fry your plantain. finished done literally took less than 30 minutes so this is like a quick meal so yeah hopefully you guys have learned something i'm just gonna go ahead and dish it so that we can eat okay i'm so, so hungry but this is literally one of my quickest go-to meals and it didn't take longer than 30 minutes i would say so if you come home from work and you're really hungry then yeah why not try this out i hope it's been useful i hope it's been inventive and yes we are going to eat so this is the plantain got my plantain in here i've got gary in here gary goes with beans and plantain so yes if you don't want gary with it it's fine it's not obligatory but i have it though i've got my gary i've got my bean stew and i've got my plantain and i can't wait to tuck in but yeah i hope to see you soon in my next video if you've enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up if not i'll see you soon take care god bless you